Hey, what's going on guys? Michael here, and today we're taking a quick look at the newest update for Microsoft Office on the iPad Pro, which finally lets you take advantage of the Apple Pencil. Starting with Word, you'll see you now have a draw option up top on the menu bar, and tapping it will show you all the new tools you have to work with, including a pen for basic markup and a traditional highlighter for highlighting text. There's also an eraser tool that will let you tap to erase individual editing marks. Now each tool allows you to select a different color for use from the preset options and also access a color wheel to help fine tune a shade or hue. The select objects tool will let you use the Apple Pencil basically as a stylus for selecting text and also for selecting and moving other elements in your document like shapes and images. When you're all finished using the review tab, you can quickly view your documents with and without your markups. Jumping over to Excel, and you'll see that the same features from Word have made their way over, but you'll also notice that the Eraser tool now has some added options, giving you not just the stroke erase, but a small and medium eraser, allowing you to scrub away at individual pixels instead of the entire markup element. PowerPoint is the last app to receive the update, and aside from the basic tools we've already discussed, you now have a pretty neat option called Convert to Shapes, which actually allows you to make rough drawings of shapes you'd like to insert into your document, and the software recognizes what you're sketching and then inserts the appropriate official shape from Microsoft Shape Library. So at the end of the day, if you're somebody who does a lot of editing and creating of Office documents on your iPad Pro and you own an Apple Pencil, I think there's a really good amount of functionality here and it's definitely an update worth checking out and makes the Microsoft Office suite even better on iOS. So that's all for today guys, hope you enjoyed this video, if you did and you want to do us a huge favor please leave us a thumbs up down below, subscribe to the channel for future videos, and we'll talk to you in the next one.